What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we have two more Hidden Fates tins. We have Gyarados, we have Raichu. Eight more packs to... When was the last time we pulled the Shiny GX? That's when we did the three tin opening. I thought we had one <laughs> yesterday, but it was Guzma, although I'm perfectly fine with that. And I did not cut this all the way. There we go. So far, this is a great product. The only thing I would complain about is, I don't know, is anyone, does anyone like the shape of these tins? It's just awkward to store cards in. I feel like the tag team tins are so much better. They store a lot of cards. It's kind of awkward because of the weird angles, but it works. It's, you just have to kind of stack them. It's not exactly square, but it works. But these ones, I just don't like it. So I would prefer just like a straight rectangle, none of this octagon stuff. Uh, let's go with Raichu this time. Reminder, we are giving away one of these tins on Friday. So check out our video from early in the week to make sure you enter. All you have to do is be a subscriber, like the video, and leave a comment, hashtag turtle giveaway. And we'll search for that hashtag in order to find the winner. And come on. So it's off to the side. I'll put the video at the end, one of those uh, clickable links. So yeah, make sure you enter. Right you right there. Four packs, and uh, yeah, just like Darian says, one of each. Let's go with the birds first. Alright, so as far as, yeah, I guess it's been more than 10 packs since we got our last shiny GX, but hey, we got that Guzma, so I'm okay with that, but hopefully we find one today. We have Nurse of Joy, Metapod, Cubone, Geodude, Eevee, Jigglypuff, Coughing, Misty's Water Command for our first rare, and then a reverse energy. We're starting to stockpile these ones, which is always nice. Three eighths hitter, guys. Three eighths, obviously. Oh, what? I was watching um Azul GG for some. Uh, I was like, oh, what what deck should I make in Pokemon PTCGO? And. So he was, I saw a video, he's running a Mewtwo deck, which is nice because of those uh, partnership tins. Now I can make a Mewtwo deck. And one thing I didn't realize is the Charizard from this set. And, you know, I feel like I kind of give it a hard time calling it super vanilla. But that Charizard is actually really good because it's GX. Erica's Hospitality. And, oh, the Pickle Rick card again. Man, we're getting so many shiny dudes, but this one is hilarious, guys. If you're not familiar with the show Rick and Morty, just Google. Actually, I bet you've seen it. They In things like Spencer's, like, they have all these Pickle Rick things. That's him. <laughs> that is as close to Pokemon equivalent as you'll ever get. I am entirely sure. But well, back to that Charizard. Hidden Face Charizard is actually really good. GX attack that does 300 damage for only 4 energy. Perfect for Mewtwo. What the hell? What does Mewtwo box mean? Like, what does box mean as far as deck types? I have no idea. If you happen to know, let me know in a comment just to clarify that for me. All right, for our third pack. So far, this um, tin is just oh, now it's pretty good. <laughs> Man, we are killing it with these. I think we have three of each now. And then just a slow book. But very nice hit right there. Man, I feel like I just opened a pack of sleeves very recently. But the thing with this set is you get so many hits that I'm almost running out. There we go. Very nice pull. Onto the Charizard pack art. But yeah, hopefully I can start building some of those decks and have some more PTCGO content that doesn't necessarily involve Picaram or Charizard, although I still like to play those decks. Alright, we have Sabrina, 
Pokemon Center Lady, Psyduck, Charmander, Magikarp, Slowpoke, Clefairy, and then a Lapras. Followed by Mr. Mime. Um, so three, no, two and three eighths hits for that tin. Um, we'll take it. No shiny GX, but definitely a good tin nonetheless. All right, four more packs. Once again, one of everything. It's off the side. Just grab a sleeve for Gyarados. Someone I used to play Poke uh, Pokemon Go with, you'd always be like, oh, get your Garys ready. Never, never was too crazy about that nickname, but got that promo Gary. All right, three more packs. Mew, you're first. They show Mew, but I don't think there is a shiny Mew in this. Well, I guess I'm not sure if this is actually a shiny Mew, but it's kind of confusing that he is a pack art. Alright, we got Electric Energy, Sabrina, Charmeleon, Misty's Termination, Whoa, Geodude, Eevee, Jigglypuff, Coughing, Staryu, and Vaporeon. Followed by a Voltorb. So, nothing in that pack. It's bound to happen. We should expect at least one of those per one of these tins. And, alright, it's been a while since we got a shiny GX. Alright, Magmar, Charmeleon, that's a cool art. Graveler, Cubone, Magikarp, Geodude, Cleep Fairy, Eevee. Electrode is our rare, followed by, oh nice, this is one we definitely want, Ralts. We've been pulling a lot of Curlia, so it's good to pull the shiny Ralts. This art is just okay, I do like the shiny, how it has that blue, really stands out. Very nice pull right there. So that's a good solid hit for this tin, hopefully we get at least one more. So yeah, I guess this isn't a Pokemon episode, but um, every once in a while, there's a, a shiny Charizard for on eBay for like uh, less than 500, like low fours, and it's like so tempting. I almost bought one yesterday. All right, Blaine's last stand, and then ooh, a Caterpie. All right, this ten. Hopefully, we get one more hit. Otherwise, that would be a, a bit of a letdown. Come on, let's get something good. Let's get a shiny GX. Come on, we don't need that curse again. Andy's fan art may have uh, a... <laughs> once, once we acknowledge the curse, it's like, oh man, it's coming back. Ekans, but let's get rid of it right here. We got Paris. Blaine again. And that's kind of off center. And then, whoa! Okay, guys. Not the shiny GX, but we did one even better. We got the Shrine of Punishment when it comes to the gold cards. Actually, I guess Tapu Lake, for, for the gold stadium, this is by far, leaps and bounds, the one I want the most. The only gold card that I would prefer is Tapu Lele, although I still think this one is more useful. Listen, well, Lele's not standard, so that's obvious. But that is a great hit right there. Man. All right. Another good tin. <laughs> Very much redeemed itself for two dud packs. And man, look at that. Looks so cool. All right, so let's recap this opening. Very successful in my book. Let's go like this. All right, we got a three ace hitter in this metal energy. Gary, Raichu. Ah, Pickle Rick Sudowoodo. A Ralts, very nice, one of my favorites. Jesse and James. Best art in the set, maybe? Probably. And then, boom! Shrine of Punishment. This card is so good. So, another successful opening, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to make sure you enter the giveaway. Um, again, you have to be subscribed, like, and hashtag turtle giveaway in a comment. Um, yeah. 
That's it for today. As always, check back in for tomorrow. We'll do some more Hidden Fates. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.